Hello YouTube, I'm here from Blue Noodle Studios and today I'm giving you another episode of my Photoshop 2 minute tip series and in this episode I'm going to be showing you how to use the swatches feature to really enhance your Photoshop experience. So just make sure that you have the swatches window open, otherwise go to the window menu and then make sure that swatches is ticked and then what I want you to do is come here, come into this little menu icon here and then tap preset manager. So here's how we can really easily delete any swatches that we don't want. So this should be pretty much how it automatically comes. If you want to completely redo your group of swatches, then you can just tap the first one, hold shift, tap the last one, and all of these will be selected, and then you can press delete. So that's how you can do it if you really want to just start anew. Otherwise, you can leave these ones here and just add your own, but I'm just going to delete them all. So... Hang on, sorry, I think I just pressed the wrong button. If we just try this again, so we just hold shift, then press the delete button. Now if we press done, everything's gone. So what we can do to add a new swatch is if we have a colour that we really like, so if we're here and we're picking a colour and I think, oh, you know what, I actually really like this shade of green, I think it could work well with something I'm working on, then you can just press add to swatches, give it a name, I might say light green, and then it will be added to your swatches and if you hover over it you can see its name as long as you haven't got any other windows open. So that's how you can just add things to your swatches. Also if you have something here and you've got this, you can just double click on this, add to swatches, I might say fresh blue and add this. And that's how you can really easily build up your own whole colour palette and it can really help with your Photoshop. So I hope you enjoyed this series, thanks for watching and I'll see you later.